Okay, here's the next part. The Siege of Hefei Castle. Hey! Council! Is our strategy agreed upon? Enough. Cheap tricks won't work at this point. We must believe in Wu's power. Win or lose. This is the end! Okay, as always, the intro. Determined to quell the rising threat from the south, Lu Zun sets out and battles with the strange Nanman troops. Following a hard battle, Wu's victory earns the respect of the Nanman army. Having gained strength, Wu is determined to advance north in order to challenge Wei for supremacy. Soon Quan leads his forces towards the new castle at Heifei. There to meet him is the veteran commander Sima Yi. In 234, the young Wu general Lu Zun makes an attempt on the castle at Heifei. Which shall prevail, the defense of Wei or the offense of Wu? The battle to determine the fate of both countries is about to begin. Okay, the equipment is a little different now that we have a third weapon, which I'm really grateful for at the moment. Uh, items are the same, bodyguards are the same, conditions are the same. If CBE is defeated, we win. If Soon Chuan is defeated, or if I die, it's the game over, and we lose. Uh, even info, really don't care. Nothing's really changed. And that's it. So, uh, let's start. The fate of Wu hangs on this battle. All units, attack the enemy's main force. Yeah, I'm gonna start on the right side. In fact, I start out on the right side. I should do. If you think you can pass, try it. What? I never lose. You're going first. I defeated an officer. Is this the end? Don't. 
don't fall behind. So now I'm going to get the uh, fairy wine. Musa wine, whatever you want to call it. Wow! You know what? Screw that. I'm just gonna grab the thing and go. Really? Make this quick. Mm. Better than I thought. <laughs> but you're still in my hands. Go for it! They're attacking from both sides. Now, concentrate all efforts on the enemy in front of us. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna take care of here. Uh, what's in there? Oh, there it is. Yeah, I'm gonna defeat Zhang He and, uh, I was gonna say Zhao Wan. Uh, Zhu Huang. I need that. All right. Show me what you've got. I have a sick joke. Great job. Be Zhang He now. You think you're gonna attack me with that? This battlefield will be your last. Sir. 
can be a beautiful thing. Really? Really? Okay, those quest balls need to go. That's everyone. Oh, that should be everybody. Yeah, now CME's morale is dropping. Uh, yeah, let's grab the weapon over here. Get out of this thing because that could hurt you big time. I forgot how much damage it does, but I know it hurts. Just keep on running. Really? Pesky private. Mm. Okay. People coming out through that gate, and 
there's no point in me doing anything until I secure it. Yeah, they put me out through that gate. I know the way reinforcements will be showing up very soon. Wait. That's one way. There it is. I'm not gonna worry about the other weapon. I'm just gonna grab the last item. Right if I see me. The reason why I came over here for it, I know for a fact that uh, Salroy and Man Chom will appear right side here. It's not that I think Soon Shran will have a problem with it. it can't be. Good. We still have manpower. Well, now that I'm here, might as well, right? Let me see. This okay, apparently... Kill them all! Okay, apparently if they arrive 15 minutes into the battle. Where's Man Chong? There he is.
Really? Wow. Wow, watch. Next game, I, next Musomo I play with a male, it's not going to be that hard. You know what? I may be staying corrected because I played with Zen G earlier and that was uh the Musa mode for that one was no problem. So they joined. I think I never I think I said this probably twice and I probably have done it once. But the thing in the bridge, don't go into. That's a trap. Uh, once you go in the center, watches will appear all around that little square section. So if you do it, you might as well have troops there before you do anything stupid. You know what? Since we're here. You know what? I'm gonna walk it because these guys are being a bunch of pricks. <laughs> I, Zhang Liao, will oppose you. All right, now is NG. I am as good as you, my lord. You're next. My dear, I wish you good fortune. We must fight well. Yeah. All right, now see me. Ye. Get this finished once and for all. Work. You are 
nothing more than child's play. That's a win. It was a somewhat of a decent amount of time. Let's see here. 21 minutes and 50, uh, 57 seconds. Eh, somewhere around there, that's not bad. So max, no, no. I'll stick with the HP. It's not like I'm going to use it again. Uh, no. Plus 19, I think that's the highest. Yeah, that's the highest that I've gotten. I basically killed everyone in that battle. Uh, when it comes to officers. 383 KOs, which isn't that bad. I only lost one bodyguard at the end. So I'll probably still get some type of bonus. It's probably gonna be like, yeah, that's what I thought. Oh yeah, and I forgot to bring it up. My bodyguards are now majors from the last battle. I'm pretty sure you guys knew that. Safe. There you have it. And here's the ending.
And that's it. That's the ending for Sun Zhang Zhang. And that's the entire Musa mode. Um. I mean, I've done this a million times. I just. I don't think we unlocked anyone. Not yet, anyway. Yeah, we didn't unlock anyone. But, uh, yeah, that was Sun Zhang Zhang's Musa mode. And. The next Musa mode. I'll be doing is Zhang Fei. So, with that, this is my gaming adventures with Dynasty Warriors 3, and uh, I'll see you for the next part, which will be the first part for Zhang Fei. Peace.